We are at the Arizona State Fairgrounds for the sixth race of season three of the SURL Grand National Series. The number 89, uh, Brett James, will be leading us to the green flag. Stand beside him is the 58, uh, Brett Davison. That's the starting lineup here for today's race. Sergeant Young enters this race with a three-point lead over Austin Abilene. Sergeant Young was the only driver in qualifying who was not able to post a time, so he'll be starting back in the 22nd position. Austin Abilene will be starting eight. Of course, the Arizona State Fairgrounds has not been made for NR2003, so we are, we are using the Santa Fe Speedway as a replacement. That is, it is the closest track to the dimensions of Arizona State Fairgrounds. So six races in, and we have already made history. Five different winners in each of the five races so far. And in the last round, Kristen Russell, who is starting in the fifth position, won the closest margin of victory in the Grand National Series, six one-thousandths of a second. So he now has two records here in the SCRL. He has won in the NASCAR Legends Series, where he has won by four one-thousandths of a second. Now he also has a record here in the Grand National Series of six one-thousandths of a second. So Russell will be looking to try and win back-to-back -back races, which has never been done in this series. And now, for those most famous words in motorsports. Drivers, stop your engines! Field is rolling off. And this is one of those weird tracks where Brett Davison, our pole setter, there he is. Let me start right there. Doesn't look like anybody's having any problems. Reach up there and pull the belts tight one more time. We are racing here at the Arizona State Fairgrounds. And there's a green flag. Off into turn number one. Into turn number two. Brent James is able to maintain his race lead as he enters turn number three into turn number four. And Brent James will lead the first lap. You see Austin Abilene trying to go past Kristen Russell. This will be for sixth. You see Sergeant Young has worked his way up to the 18th position. But he is still outside of the points. You see Brent Davison is trying to go for the race lead. Here we go. Brent James is fighting on the outside. He's trying to keep that race lead. And he's able to cut down in front of the 58 car. Not the final turn. But James will lead that lap as well. But Davidson fight him on the inside line. Just like he did one lap ago. But James fights back on the outside line. Davidson fighting back on the inside line. It's about off turn number four. Looks like the 58 will lead that last. We have a lead change. You see the 82, uh, Breezy Bisbane is also right behind him. So he's trying to stay in contact with him in case something happens. You see Russell has fallen back to the 8th position, so I don't think he's going to win back-to-back -back races. You see Sergeant Young has worked his way inside the top 14, so he will gain some points as of right now. 58 continues to hold the race lead. He's got 10 laps to go to Arizona State Fairgrounds. The front three have never won in the Grand National Series. You see Josh Barker. He is still looking for his first cup win or Grand National win as well. You see Austin Abilene. He is the highest winner here in this series. And fifth, you got to check a desk watcher who won at Carroll Speedway. 
Back up front, no change as the 58 car has pulled away a little bit from the 89. Sergeant Young is now in the 13th position, so he will gain two points. Since 14th place gives you only one. You see Christian Russell back to the 8th position. It's still a good point save for Russell, but you know he wants to try and win back-to-back -back races, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. Unless something drastic happens. As Brent Davison leads slap number 8. We got seven laps to go. Almost all the drivers are single file, which usually happens on these tracks. You see the 78 car, Addy J, trying to pass Bronson Minnick and does. That will be for the 18 position. As 58 car leads, yet another lap. The lead is 1.8. The next time you'll be seeing the SCRL Grand National Series will be race number seven at the North Wilkesboro Speedway. So that should be a fun little race. And then we will continue to stay on the short track as we head to Martinsville for the first time here in season three. You see the 120 car, uh, Brian Gigsby has passed 81 to Sergeant Young. So Sergeant Young is now back in the 14th position. That will put him in the last position to uh, gain points. And because the season is 41 races long, you need every point that is valuable. So every position. So you need to try and finish your points as much as possible. As Austin Abilene is in the fifth position, he came in minus three, so Austin will obviously gain the points lead after this race. But you have three laps to go. Brett Davison continues to hold the race lead over Brett James. No challenge from behind as the last place driver is now Amber Reed. Up to her number four. Two laps to go for Brett James. And I believe if he can hold on for the next two laps, he will have another first-time winner because he has never won here in this series or this league. In the turn number three, no challenge from behind. He has a 1.9 second lead in the turn number three. In the turn number four, Brett James will see the white flag one lap to go here at Arizona State Fairgrounds. He started in the second place. He battled with Brett James for several laps. He finally was able to pass him. He has pulled away to an over two-second lead. He came into this series having never won a series, a race in his career. Off the final turn, he dominates, and he will win the first ever race here at the Arizona State Fairgrounds. Brett Davison wins. Another first-time winner. Here we race results. Brett Davidson holds on and scores his first career SCR Grand National Series win. Second was Brett James. Third, Breezy Brisbane. Four, Josh Barker. Six, Austin Abilene. Six, Jack Deskwatcher. Seven, Cole O'Ash. Eighth, Kristen Russell. Ninth, Chris Tucker. And tenth was Roger James. Yes, he race results. We had all 22 drivers finish race on the lead lap. No one was out. Well, that completes race number six of the season. We'll take you to Victor Lane for the first time in his SCR Grand National Series career with number 58 of Brent Davison. Here are your point standings after the sixth race of the season at Arizona State Fairgrounds. Austin Abilene has regained the points lead. He entered Arizona minus three. He leaves plus 26. Third is Josh Barker. He gains two spots. He is 130 points behind. 
Fourth is Joe's Notary, 147 points behind. And fifth is Jeremiah Weaver, 163 points behind. Rest your point standings on the screen. We'll next see you for round number seven at the North Wilkesboro Speedway. And until then, keep the hammer down, and we'll see you at the track.